Well, the countdown is on to Christmas. It's begun with the last full shopping weekend before the holiday. It's estimated that 50% of us, though, still have our, to finish up our lists. Traditionally today, which is being called Super Saturday, is usually the Saturday before Christmas, but because Christmas Eve is next Saturday, it was moved up. Lisa Benson spent the day with shoppers on the plaza. Lisa. Well, Amy, the shoppers I spoke to were in good spirits and were enjoying the weather while spending money on Super Saturday. The sights and sounds of the holiday were in full bloom on the Country Club Plaza as shoppers showed up for Super Saturday. Today I'm just finishing up stocking stuffers and my daughter's birthday is at Christmas time. Very behind. I teach and, and we're not quite finished yet with teaching. So. I wait. Um, I'm lazy. Procrastinate all the time. Typically, the Saturday before Christmas is the last weekend for procrastinators to launch their last-minute shopping expedition. But this year, Christmas Eve is on a Saturday, and retailers plan to be open, which is great news for last-minute shoppers. With three kids, three and under, I tend to just wait until the last minute and see what I need and go finish up my shopping. While others have already made plans for Christmas Eve. I'll be cooking. Yeah, cooking for dinner. We've got 15, 14 or 15 for dinner the next day, so that's what I'll be doing. The National Retail Federation has actually raised its holiday shopping forecast, now expecting a 3.8% increase in sales over last year. That amounts to $4 billion, an increase these plaza retailers are working extended hours to earn. Now shoppers have one more Saturday before the big day, Christmas Eve Saturday. But you should know that a lot of retailers will close at 6 o'clock. Lisa Benson, NBC Action News.